Welcome to this video. Let's explore the impressive hardware functions of this powerful router board, the BPI-R3. It's based on the MediaTek MT7986 chip, aka Philogic 830. With its 4-arm Cortex-A53 cores running at up to 2 GHz, this board offers a processing power of up to 18,000 MIPS. MediaTek FastPath technology offers low-latency performance for games and AR-VR applications using the 6 GHz spectrum. Wi-Fi 6 via 4Transmit 4 Receive Antenna Array provides lower latency, greater bandwidth capacity, and faster transfer rates. 2.4G by MT7975 N chip and 5G by MT7975 P chip. To meet various connectivity needs, the BPI-R3 comes equipped with double 2.5 Gigabit Ethernet SFP slots. You can directly connect the fiber optic cable using 2.5 Gigabit Ethernet SFP fiber optic modules. No need to connect another fiber optic converter or install 2.5 Gigabit Ethernet SFP RJ45 modules to get an extra port for standard wired network connections. The BPI-R3 also offers 5 1 Gigabit Ethernet RJ45 ports. The leftmost port can be used as the WAN port or LAN port, providing flexibility in network configuration. For users requiring mobile connectivity, the BPI-R3 features a MPCIe slot with USB 2.0 connectivity. This slot can be used for a 4G modem, such as the Quetel EC25e, and is accompanied by a micro SIM card slot on the back. Need additional USB ports? The BPI-R3 has you covered with a USB 3.0 Type-A port providing a maximum current of 1400 mA. Most mobile hard drives should be supported, but if needed, consider adding a USB hub that supports additional power supply. Additionally, there is a USB 2.09 pins header offering a maximum current of 500 mA. You can use a 9 pins to USB Type-A adapter to utilize this port. The BPI-R3 is equipped with 2GB of DDR4 RAM and an 8GB eMMC flash, providing sufficient resources for installing the OpenWRT system and a wide range of applications. It also includes 128MB SPI NAND and 32MB SPI NOR for additional storage options. Expand your storage further with the micro SD card slot, allowing you to easily add extra capacity to the BPI-R3. Switch bootstrap functionality is available through a 4-bit DIP switch. It allows you to easily switch between SPI NOR, SPI NAND, eMMC flash, and micro SD card. The BPI-R3 router board offers a versatile M.2 slot key M with only PCIe 2.0 Multiply 2 interface. This slot supports NVMe SSDs for high-speed storage, or can be used to connect a Wi-Fi 6E card, such as AW7916NPD, using the BPI-M.2 to MPCIe adapter. Looking for additional storage options or a way to DIY a NAS, users interested in using multiple mechanical hard drives with SATA interfaces can achieve this by adding an additional M.2 to SATA adapter card. This opens up possibilities for DIY NAS. The BPI-R3 offers extensive GPIO pins, including DART, I2C, SPI, PWM, and I2S interfaces. These pins provide developers with flexibility in integrating the board with other devices and sensors. Convenient buttons are available on the board, including an RST button and a WPS button. The WPS button enables quick and easy wireless device connections to your router. For developers, the BPI-R3 provides debug UART pins, allowing easy access for debugging and testing purposes. The board is powered by a 12 volts 2 amps DC power supply. When connected, the VH3.96 2 pins connector next to it can directly receive power. Within the power range allowed by the power supply, users can connect an additional 12 volts appliance. Furthermore, the XH2.544 pins connector on the board can provide 5 volts 3 amps or 12 volts 2 amps output, expanding the available power options. The BPI-R3 router board features two 5 volts fan PH2.0 connectors, one with two pins and another with PWM3 pins. These connectors allow users to connect fans and regulate their speed, ensuring optimal cooling performance. That concludes our overview of the BPI-R3 router board's impressive hardware functions. With its powerful specifications and versatile features, the BPI-R3 is a reliable and flexible solution for various networking needs. Thank you for watching.
For more information and updates, please visit our website.